Hello again. It's been a while. Hope you're doing well. So, as you may know me, William Clapp, Mr. Iron Will, that one guy that I forgot to subscribe to, whatever you want to call me, I'm back. And yes, it's been quite a few months. Recently uploaded a Pals episode. Hope you guys enjoyed that. It was totally wholesome and nothing ever went wrong in it whatsoever. But yeah, it's good to be back. I've been meaning to make videos for quite some time, but I'm only now just getting to it. First order of business I want to address is I got some new equipment, if you couldn't tell by this dramatic lighting. I have two lights, but I'm only using one because I don't really need to use two currently. And maybe I won't ever need to use two, at least for a while. So, PALS will definitely look a lot better, and I'm very much looking forward to that, and also future projects. But we'll get to that in a second. This is a very organized um, vlog update. Uh, uh, all of the script is on this sticky note. A total of uh, four things, if you can uh, see that. First order of business, freelancing. So, when it comes to freelancing, I recently uploaded a, a little advertisement for video editing, which, if any of you are interested, I do offer freelance video editing over on Fiverr. The other thing I didn't advertise, but I might still upload, depending if I feel like it or not, is voice acting. Now, that's the thing I'm pushing much more than video editing, and I've actually gotten a few clients over there, which is very nice, but... As of right now, I haven't seen too much work, and I'm really hoping that that can build and progress throughout the year and years to come. So, uh, if you ever want to hear my buttery voice in a future project of yours, just uh, hit me up. But yes, freelancing, link in the description below. You can also find it in my About section and whatnot. <laughs> so, when it comes to projects, recently I started a podcast, The Night Tide Train... <clears throat> Wait... <clears throat> The Nighttime Train Ride! <laughs> that was disgusting. <laughs> but yes, the Nighttime Train Ride. It was an idea I had for a while. I didn't really get to it until... Oh, I think I uploaded that in February, I think? Yeah, I didn't really get to it until February. But basically, with being in quarantine, couldn't really do much. So I was like, well, what if I made it all auditory? I can't really film, so I'll just record. I got a fancy schmancy microphone. <laughs> oh, I could do ASMR. Hey. It's me. <laughs> Anyways, Nighttide Train Ride. So, it was a little bit of a passion project of mine. And I still want to make more episodes, but I think what's going to happen with that is I want to make all the episodes first and then release them because it seems like you guys enjoyed it which you know I'm very grateful for but yeah I'm not sure when they're gonna come out but they don't take too long to make maybe like two or so weeks per episode it's really just the script that takes a lot once the script is done it's it's easy it's boom easy peasy lemon squeezy greasy greasy so yeah night tide train ride expect more episodes Maybe not this summer. I'm probably aiming for fall to start releasing them. But again, I got to get more out. And I also got to find how many episodes I want in a season. Do I just want it to be all one season, multiple seasons? We'll see how it goes. But the real meat and potatoes for today's vlog update is Pals. Now, Pals, my baby, my sweet darling child of a web series, it, 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 it's, it's, it's happening. <laughs> season 2 has been kind of on a... Season 2 has been kind of on a hiatus. Hiatus. Uh. Season 2 has been messy because of school for a while. I couldn't really work on anything. And also figuring out when to film and also quarantine. Which, actually, you know, quarantine hasn't been too bad with in COVID. It hasn't been too bad with it because I it's, it's just me. Now, I don't know if you guys know this, but I'm quite the actor. I bet you had no idea that it was all me. But I play every single character, and I gotta say, it. where's my Oscar? <laughs> but yeah, the meat and potatoes, pals. I just wanted to announce, because I have a full series, not just the season, but the full series layout of episodes. Let's just break it down. I'll probably put some graphic I made quickly in an hour up on the screen to make it all look pretty and everything. But essentially, there's going to be four seasons. Seasons two and three, like season one. It's going to be 12 episodes each. That's 12. 
And then season four is only going to be four episodes, but they're going to be big, chalky, big boy episodes. Like, season one finale level episodes. Like, yeah, 45 to an... 45 minutes to an hour long episodes for season four because what I have planned, you know, Peter goes to space and it's crazy. But yeah, it's a whole thing and I'm very excited for it. But I have the whole layout and I'll have all of the episode titles on the screen in some fashion. I'll figure it out later. I'm really looking forward to more Palace episodes. I've already started writing the next episode and it's, I'm really excited for the next episode because it's art part two, which is art part one and season one was one of my favorite episodes it actually might be my favorite episode period but yeah I, i've always wanted to make a part two because there's a lot more things that they could do and oh, it's just gonna be fun <laughs> but with pals out of the way the real mean potatoes what else is there to look forward to well i will probably give more vlog updates when these sexy shades <laughs> i don't know why i wear these shades i it looks i don't know future projects yeah um top of my head obviously the big boy venture into the cosmos the rebellious renegades the sequel to the first venture in cosmos <sighs> listen we were originally gonna film it last summer but a, a funny thing happened and it didn't work out <laughs> honestly i am kind of glad it didn't work out because there's the first first or second draft of the script is done but there's a lot of things i want to rewrite and tweak up the bulk of the story's there it's just little things that i feel like could be said better or done better or explained better you know so i'm gonna really uh take it to the workshop hammer it in get everything i can get done done over there you know i'm estimating it's hard to say but if i really had to try to guess because, you know, everyone has lives in school and whatnot. I'm guessing filming that will take place next summer. And, again, things could change. It is very much up for change. However, <laughs> I'm guessing it's going to be an early 2023 release. It's hard to because I really... I, it sucks, but that's my guess. And oh, the first one came out, what, 2019? So... 2021 four years after the first one more or less so we're already what two years three years now i don't know anymore time is an illusion at this point it's just always going and you just gotta roll with it <laughs> that was okay <laughs> but yeah venture into the cosmos the rebellious renegades is still happening i just have no idea when and once the world is back to normal which things are looking up right now i'm it's it's gonna happen so don't worry if you were worried, or maybe you don't care, I don't know. Other projects in the future, um, the only other thing I can think of is the comparing series. That's not one I'm super passionate about, but it does, <laughs> unfortunately, get views. It's like, it's fine. I had one idea to compare Resident Evil 7 and 8, because, uh, but the thing is, I I'm like a creator. I'm not like a reviewer, so it's like, I don't know, but who cares anymore I'll, I'll probably i'll probably do something with a comparing series yeah because i know you guys enjoy it i do enjoy it it's just not something i'm like i must create another one you know like i don't have gusto for it it's just but we'll we'll we'll, we'll see we'll we'll see what happens only other thing i can think of at the top of my head is Stickman mcgee now i brought him back as sort of this nostalgic nostalgic well nostalgic for me personally but I kind of I kind of brought him back as this old original character video and I just I thought it'd be fun to have him out and about again yeah you know, I made the one special uh, months ago and I'd like to make others it would definitely not be consistent and I wouldn't have some massive schedule or like season five of this and bleh. excuse me onion rings it, it's definitely uh, gonna be an every now and then kind of show and I, I did enjoy making it, and it was very nostalgic for me to voice Stickman McGee again and, and to draw him again. I had to look up how to draw him because I didn't remember. But, yeah, I, I I wouldn't mind making more episodes. And I've already talked to a friend of mine, and he, he likes it a lot. And uh, we might start writing together. Like, each script would be about, like, five pages, so it wouldn't take too long. But, yeah, I have ideas. But maybe expect that in the future, just no idea when. 
Only other thing I can think of is I, I know I want to make more skits again, like how I did back in my the heyday of Iron Wheel Productions. I'm a rapping gamer. Yeah, I, I'd like to make more skits again. I think that would be a lot of fun. Um, I have a few ideas, but um, it's also hard to get friends together. But with things kind of sort of opening back up and regulations being moved and whatever, it, it, it basically it's looking up and I might make more weird crap again. So um, look forward to it, probably, maybe. Hopefully. Do I have anything else? Um. I'm gonna make an ASMR channel. It's gonna be great. My phone went off. I didn't put it on vibrate. I'm a failure. 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 Could you imagine if I made an ASMR channel? Just I honestly, I think it'd be kind of fun, but, you know, well, you never know what the future has in store. Yeah, I'm open to the possibilities. How about you? <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, um, um, to sum up, freelancing, pals, um, nighttime train ride, or nighttime train ride, <laughs> nighttime train ride, pals, and... Uh, a lot of other projects I'm working on in the future and will hopefully release uh, someday. So, yeah. All right. Uh, thank you all so much for tuning in. And I will see you all in the next video. It's been fun catching up. I really like making vlog updates. I, I should do them more. Maybe just make standard vlogs. Who knows? Again, I'm open to the possibilities. <laughs> see you later. <laughs> goodbye. I don't Did I have a traditional goodbye? Um... Bye. I think that was it. Yeah. Yeah, we'll go with that. Bye-bye. <laughs> Short. <laughs>